Now in the trot work, we've been working on keeping it super, super, super forward, really forward thinking, fast, 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 is my only um, thinking when I'm trotting um, from what I've been learning. So you can see it is pretty fast, <laughs> it's pretty big. Um, especially in the half pass, you would rather keep it forward and compromise bend than get the bend but lose the forward. And again, I'm actually working on those medium trots because apparently they're not big enough or good enough. Um, <laughs> but <laughs> everything can be better, I suppose. And if we want this horse to really score, he's got the movement to score, I just need to be brave enough and skilled enough to ask for it and make sure it comes out. And now we're just testing the brakes again because again, he doesn't love anything about Piaf or Passage scares him. Um, so we have to keep doing it to prove to him that it's nothing bad and there's nothing to worry about, but I can only do it for short periods of time. And you can see even in that passage, he has gears um, and he has to make sure, so that ha that's a half pass, um, but it doesn't look like a half pass because it's so, 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 so forward. But um, that's just what I have to make sure that he's constantly, Geordie says the feeling has to be that he's galloping off on you all the time, that he's just going, going, going. And you can see there, I use the whip a little bit. Um, I didn't use it on him, I just changed it over in the hand. You can see he goes, okay, I'm going, I'm going, and that's what we want. Um, and he has to be this forward thinking when I do the passage, um, so he doesn't think of stopping and running backwards, that passage is still going forward, Piaf is still going forward. If we, if we force him to do anything, he's just going to flat out say no. And at the end of the day, a Grand Prix horse has to want to do it. And whether or not he will ever want to do it is um, something that we still want to find out. Um, but it's definitely, it's definitely fun working with him because he definitely has the ability to do it. And now we're just going to get his brain to want to work with us. But you can see he's a happy horse. The, we've let the reins go and he's like, oh yes, I'm happy. So trust you enjoyed seeing our session. If you would like some more dressage help, I have a completely free ultimate seat package, which is filled with videos, training plans, a 30 day training plan, uh, bonus videos and bonus explanations of what you need to do in your training for the next 30 days. I would love to give that to you for free. Just click on the link below and check that out. And remember, Live your dreams. <laughs>